Breaking story we're following in Raleigh where the state health plan board of trustees just voted to delay a vote on premium changes that would affect thousands of North Carolinians. WNCN's political reporter Bo Minnick was at that meeting and he joins us with the latest. Sharon, this is a major change out here. Just within the last half hour, the state health plan board of trustees, as you mentioned, it voted to, in essence, not vote not vote today on the two controversial measures that it was taking up. One of them had to do with cost sharing. The other one had to do with increasing premiums for the nearly 700,000 state employees and retirees who in North Carolina who get their health coverage through the state health plan. So they're delaying it by a four to three vote until May 1st. The significance of May 1st is that's when the General Assembly will come back into session Though the question still remains whether they actually will be able to even take up this measure this year by waiting that long. We're piecing through a lot of stuff here, so we'll continue to follow this. We'll put it all together and have much more coming up for you in a live report ahead at 7 o'clock, including reaction from people at the meeting. Live in Raleigh, Bo Minnick, WNCN News Now. All right.